Hi guys, this is Dr. Baker. I had a question from uh, someone who wanted to see a picture of a fracture uh, in an MRI. So this is an MRI of um, the low back, also called lumbar spine. And this right here is what we call L5 vertebra. This is a disc. This is L4. This is L3. This is L2 and this is L1. This is T12, which is thoracic 12. And as you can see, a normal vertebra is supposed to look like this, somewhat rectangular. It's got a normal height. The disc is well hydrated, except this bone here is broken. It is crushed. Not only has it lost its height which is supposed to look like this now it's crushed it is also now going backwards to give you some perspective this dark thing here is the spinal cord it's running back down here and the white stuff in the front and back is the spinal fluid nothing should be pressing the spinal cord in this setting here the bone is shoved into the spinal cord and as you scroll forward and backward you can see that the bones effect on the spinal cord is worse on one side than the other, but all over pretty bad. And the spinal cord is crushed here. And in this patient, uh, the patient had a spinal cord injury and uh, required a surgery, which I can show in a separate video how I corrected that. But the goal was to remove this entire bone away and reconstruct the spine so that there is, we eliminate this acute bend. You can see this bend goes like this and then goes like this. There should be a nice transition from the thoracic spine to lumbar spine in a normal setting. And um, she had almost no movement in her legs and after surgery, she regained all function, mostly because the surgery was done soon after her injury. Hope that helps.